Welcome back to Chatterbox and welcome to another song reaction. Today is a two man crew. It's me and RV. How are you doing? You good? I'm good, P. I just, um, I just checked what the score was in the uh, FA Cup, and unfortunately, our team's no longer in it. So yeah. uh, <laughs> that's that was just a little bit of a depressing reminder. But yeah, Manchester City's playing, and um, Tottenham is also playing. So I was just having a look at the score quickly. But yeah, I mean, sometimes it's nice that your team's not playing in midweek, so you got other things to do. But mm -hmm. other times, it's just a reminder of how bad they are. Yeah, I, I I stopped following football for a while. It's just like every time I turn on TV, it's funny you watch football. And you walk away depressed. I can't yeah, take it any longer. It's true. Manchester United is just making us very depressed. Yeah. Well, today we are going to have something special. Have you ever heard of a woman called Raja Kamari? Nope. Raja Never Kamari. Never. I, she's one of my favorite female singers. Mm -hmm. Now, I've heard a few songs from her. I love her flow. I love her presence on screen. And she just blows me away every time that I hear a song from her. Now, for the subscribers that are watching, do not forget to hit that subscribe button. Bam. And make sure that you like this video. So let's check it out. Raja Kumari and the song is NRI. Oh, I love this one. Love her outfits. This is it. Oh. Mm. Mm. Look at those. Ooh. Love that scene. Simple video, but really good. Wow, I, I really like her. I would say if I had to compare her to a British artist, she reminds her style is like Lady Leshaw. Um, in terms of how she comes across on screen. She has that presence. She's very dynamic. The video was simple. You can tell a lot of money wasn't spent on it, but it was creative. And um, um, the chorus was very catchy. I really liked it. I'm a big fan of hers, so I'm quite biased. Um, anything she puts out, I always check it out. I love this woman. What do you think? Mm, yeah, I mean, she's she come across very, very interesting in that video, not only because... Uh, she's clearly very talented in terms of, of her, her vocals. Her, her actual singing voice is very good. But her lyrics were quite deep as well. And her rapping ability was um, probably a lot more sort of... Um, sort of more, more of a sort of a 
style that I thought I would like. Yeah. I mean, I, I didn't expect her rapping style to be one that I would, um, you know, enjoy as much. Put it that way, because a lot of modern female rappers, I find there's usually something about the way they rap that puts me off, but not her. That she was really, really good. I, I was, I was so impressed with that. That was um, not only her flexibility and her vast talent, obviously, but her attitude in that video was kind of like. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys what I uh, what I'm feeling with this song because that, that song was quite deep in terms of what it was what it was meaning. It, there was a lot of references to like British imperialism and like uh, you know taking taking over and not allowing uh, Indians to be who they are. Yeah. So um, she made a lot of reference to that kind of thing. So it was quite powerful as well. She was just like it was well my, written. The song was well written. It was good. yeah. I mean she was tackling a lot of dark themes they're like oh my my indian uh, ness offends you and like how brown i am is like uh, you know something that you can't take or something uh, and you you know that kind of thing i'm therefore i'm going to like shove it in your face even more which is really kind of powerful and just be like you know you, you gotta accept me for who i am kind of thing so it was very very her confidence was coming out onto the screen and, and like you said about the video i think it was Maybe not the most complex, but it was good enough for what needed to be done. I yeah. think she showed a lot of color. She was wearing something which looked like a, a crown on her head. Yeah. And she was wearing like uh, some kind of, I don't know what Indian dress it was, but it was definitely obviously an Indian type of dress, a very colorful. Um, and it just looked like it represented who she is. And she's probably, um, like a lot of people, a hybrid, like, um, you know, an, literally an NRI, non-resident Indian. She's Indian, but she's not living in India, and therefore she's probably either grown up in, like, Canada or the UK or the States or wherever she's from. And it's just different. It's just different growing up as a non-sort of white person in these places. And, and she's, she's speaking her truth, so, or, you know, hats off to her. When I see her videos, and I've seen quite a few of her videos, I don't think they get enough credit um, mm. where credit is due. I mean, every one of her videos, I haven't seen a video so far that I'm like, no, that is a really rubbish song. I've enjoyed every single song that she's put out. I like mm. a lot of her videos. I think this is the most simplistic video that I have seen out of all of them. The lyrics make up for it. The beat is fantastic. I, I think I saw a song where she did a um, collaboration with Moose Wellia. Yeah. That was the first time I actually saw her. Mm -hmm. And from when I saw her there, I was like, wow. I think she was on the beach and my mouth was like, ah. Oh. I was like, <laughs> wow, she's stunning. So I'm a big fan of hers and I'm really biased. Hey, that was our reaction to Raja Kumari for NRI. We thought it was fantastic. We loved it. We want to see a lot more. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and share. Please check us out on Patreon. And we thank you constantly for the support that you're giving the channel. All the best and peace.